I really think the emphasis has to be you can't educate people to use bad infrastructure. Uh, what you need to do, and, and it will take time, but what the city needs to do is make sure that we're delivering and retrofitting infrastructure that um, is conducive to safe behaviors from motorists, cyclists, um, and pedestrians. So I think the physical modifications of the roadway, you know, I, I, I accept that feedback from the public that we need to do more there. I agree. We've made a lot of physical mo modifications to, to intersections to, to reduce the number of uh, traffic collisions, particularly right turn movements and, and follow too close movements. I think we need to start investing more in uh, safer uh, crosswalks and pedestrian infrastructure uh, consistent with what Councillor Anderson was proposing, for example. So our whole approach to our transportation system, I, I think we need to be clearer about prioritizing vulnerable road users, particularly pedestrians and cyclists, and, and uh, particularly with an aging population, seniors uh, who need to be accommodated, uh, particularly on our sidewalks and intersections. And so um, that's a huge contributing factor to reaching Vision Zero, is improving pedestrian safety, and so uh, that's, that's what I focused on in my remarks today.